you've got your to-do list. Maybe you've watched some of these life lessons videos, you're planning your life out, your day out. But then you hear something, the bomb has been planted. This really does a number to your to-do list because you know what's important now. Running to the bomb and defusing it. You're in Counter-Strike and I am talking about the book Essentialism by Greg McEwen. These are gaming life lessons and book notes. So from that book, he says, you cannot underestimate the importance of practically everything. The book is just about identifying the important things in your life and that also means really identifying all the unimportant things in your life that you can get rid of so that you can focus on the important things. Back to that to-do list. Like I said, once you see that alert, everything else on here. Maybe you're supposed to pick up groceries, do a little bit of your homework, who knows what it is. Mow the lawn, but once the bomb's planted, beeline to the bomb site. You gotta take care of that. So nothing on the to-do list is important. The only thing you're focused on is getting there uh, so that you can defuse the bomb. Otherwise you lose the round. So how does this apply to life? In life we have these lists of things that we want to do, things we want to accomplish. What you want to do is just take a look at everything that you're doing, uh, maybe in your day, and ask why uh, you're doing these different things. See if you can align them to your larger goals, and that's a subject for another video, how to set goals and plan the bigger picture, but the things that you're doing today, make sure that they are aligning to something bigger. Um, not to say like you don't take care of the little things because that is important, that's the most important thing, but those little things do add up and they should add up to something bigger. Even something like making your bed, uh, that adds up to just being someone that takes care of something first thing in the morning to set themselves up in a positive mindset for the rest of the day. So uh, if you take a look at the list of things today that you did, this is important too, just understanding yourself also means understanding where your time is going. Sometimes you can look at your entire day and realize that there was only one thing really that mattered today. Uh, the rest of the day was wasted. Um, not to say that you shouldn't have leisure, but maybe even when you're trying to relax, you aren't focused because you have, you're anxious about something else that you've been procrastinating on. If you had handled that, then you could take your leisure and get into your recovery and be present when you're hanging out with friends, things like that. But because you messed up the one thing that mattered today, then it kind of throws the rest of the day off. Back to the game, so there's just a lot of different things you could be thinking about. Um, just strategy, practicing your aim, buying these weapons. Who knows? Who knows what you're thinking uh, once the round starts. And in the same sense, all, all of those aspects could be important. In the same sense, there's a lot of pillars in your life. Uh, nutrition, taking care of your body, taking care of your mind. All of this is important. And then within everything, there is like sub pillars. Uh, if you're practicing aim, you know, you're not going to practice every single gun or you won't get good at any of them. Same thing with like knowledge of maps. You, you won't, if you're, I don't know, high level competitor, which I'm not, never have been. Um, but you know what map you're going to be playing, what maps you're going to be playing, roughly, like some rotation. That means that you don't need to focus on learning deeply the intricacies of some random custom map that you found online. And in the same way, with the sub-pillars of the things in your life, a lot of people can, I think an example is fasting or like meal timing, things like that. People focus on some sub-pillar when really they don't have everything else in order that matters more. Uh, so something like taking care of your sleep will pay div if that's something you're struggling with, that's going to pay dividends. That's something really essential is having the proper rest every night. So when you are going to defuse the bomb, you also want to make sure to, again, this is like making your bed, make sure to do the essentials that set you up properly. Buy a defuse kit. Not great to get to the, the right bomb site and not have the defuse kit. So 
build some good habits, and I have some videos about that. I'm gonna make more gaming life lessons and book notes videos, so please subscribe if you like this. Let me know what games or books you wanna hear about, and thanks a lot for checking this out.